All right, today's video, we are going to review my new compound bow. I got a uh, Bear Cruiser G2 2017 model. So this is the 2017 Bear Archery Cruiser G2. Um, nice entry level bow, about a $400 bow right out of the box. Comes with a Trophy Ridge 4-pin sight that is lighted. You can turn this on and it'll light if you're in a low light situation. Your pins will light up. Comes with a Trophy Ridge Whisker Biscuit um, arrow rest like this. There's a lot of different information out there about a lot of different rests. Um, I'm just getting started so I want things to be really basic until I can move up and get into something a little more extreme. This has been a really nice rest. I've, I've only fired this bow maybe 20 times, 30 times. Um, the only issue I've had with it is right out of the box, the top cam had a pretty good lean to it. And um, when they set it up for me, they lasered in the uh, whisker biscuit. And that, of course, once I straightened up the cam lean, set my trajectory of my arrow off. So I got that all straightened up. Now I'm just working on finishing sighting it in. Um, light. Right now I have it set to 55 pounds. It's like I said, I'm just getting started. I want to get familiar with using a compound bow. Um, but otherwise I've been pretty happy with it. Um, comes with a wrist strap and a damper. And um, yeah, that's the bow. Let's take a look at some of the other things that I got. Oh yeah, it also comes with a nice five, one, two, three, four, yeah, five arrow quiver. Uh, which is great because I've already broke one of my compound arrows. Um, the arrows I chose just for getting started. These are the Vital Impact Carbon. Um, I've got the 400 spine, plastic veins. Uh, got a nice pointed field tip. I uh, got my draw length set to 28 inches, so I've got my arrows cut to 29 and a half. Also chose a um, True Fire uh, trigger release dual jaw. Been really happy with this so far. Um, again, just getting started, so learning a lot. Um, another thing that the bow comes with on the uh, G2 is it comes with two more additional sets of cams. Um, you've got two cams to be able to adjust in half inch increments on draw and then you've got a full draw so there's no there's no adjustment on it it's just full draw what I have on it right now are the one inch increment uh, cam adjust or draw adjusters so that's kind of a nice feature if you want to get a little bit more detailed in your draw length adjustment um, so that's my bow setup let's uh, let's get set up and take a few shots All right, so this first set I'm gonna shoot is gonna be at 20 yards. And uh, if I'm happy with that, I'll go ahead and move back to 30. And then on back to 40. So, here we go. All right, that second shot, I know that I, I pulled the bow a little bit when I released, so I know that's why that one's high, but height on these two is pretty good. I'm shooting a little bit to my left, um, but I'm gonna continue to shoot with it set like it is, get more familiar with it before I make too many more adjustments. I think I'm pretty close. All right, let's go on back to 30 yards.
don't have a lot of explanation for those um, kind of all over the place but again I'm going to give this a little more time of practicing with it before I get too carried away with adjustments um, if anybody's got any recommendations for me certainly leave a comment down below don't forget to subscribe and uh, tell me what you think of what I'm doing here now I'm going to go ahead and shoot 40 yards Yeah, you heard it. I stuck that one right in that plywood, and it's hard plywood. This is why you always want to put hay bales around your target. They're hard to get out of there. Um, more spread. A little more off to the left. So I think I'm going to go ahead and get that, uh, that sight adjusted a little better. And uh, we'll try this again and see what we got going on. Don't forget to subscribe, leave me a comment, anything you want to tell me, be happy to hear it. Like I said, I'm just getting started, so anybody that's got some experience, feel free to let me know what you think.